Um, uh, hello everyone, uh, welcome back to WebCotech Full Stack Web Development course. Uh, today we are going to be working us through on what is HTML headings, headings in HTML. But before we go to the class, before we go to today's topic, I would like us to go back to what we talked about in our last class so we in our last class we talked about structures and let us go to the file this is the file we created for our last class structures.html uh yeah in our last class we talked about how an html document looks the basic form of an html particularly html5 and for we to know which form of which version of HTML we are writing, we said we are to declare here the version of HTML we are using. And for HTML5, we use the uh, doc type declaration. So this is this tag here indicates or uh, is telling us the version of HTML we are using. So which is what HTML5. Now we say it also that html uh we said also that html document should be should start from the what well, the html tag the opening tag and the closing tag the opening tag just uh just uh, just as what uh the greater the less than sign followed by the html the name of the tag then followed by a greater than sign and the closing tag also has the same in addition with a word a forward stroke a slash <coughs> so that is that about opening and closing tag so we said an html document should start from what uh, an html tag after the html tag we have our heading our end so the head tag contains information about the page so whatever information you want to put on the page on your html document uh it should be between the word the head tag and you should know that the head, the information the the tags or anything in between this head tag is not visible in the browser now i can see we have one of the tag we can place under the a tag is what well, the title the title tag and the title tag is telling us is just telling us the title of our document so the title of our what of our document so the title of our document here is what our uh, html structures so html structure that's the title of our web page here and it is not visible in the body of the browser but it is i said something last last in our last class that the the title here is visible in a tab so in the in the in the browser's tab so whenever you load for example let us copy the parts to this file let us copy the part and let us check let us check Now I can see we have HTML, HTML looks. This is the what we are coming back to. The, but what, what I want to say is about this the title. I can see the title of this of the of our HTML is what of our web page is HTML structure. I can see HTML structure. This is where where which this is the essence of our title tag. So anything you put in the title tag will be visible in the world in the tab in the browser's tab now after that i talked about the body the body tag the opening and closing tag is what contains all the documents or all the contents in our in our in our web page so for example when i visit the browser when i check the browser i can see we have how html looks so this is shown in the browser because it is placed in between the word the body tag it is placed in between the word the body tag now 
One thing I forgot to talk about in our last class is our comment. So comment in HTML, comment in HTML starts with a less than sign with an exclamation mark and two dashes. So I can see to write a comment in what in HTML for before we even go that what is the essence of comment in a in a in a in a web page? So the essence of comment is just to let us know what we write in our uh, in, in our code so what we did so because sometimes you can you, you, you some some code you'd have do, uh, do some things for a, for some years back and you would like to come back to check that uh, what did i even do here and then what 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 did i so comments will guide you so if you write a com a good comment in your what in your code it is going to guide you it's going to let you remember or recall what you did in your what in your code so and to write a comment, a comment starts from a less than sign followed uh, followed by an exclamation and uh, and two dash, two dash. So then you it is then you can write this in a line, the same line. So and don't forget also comment is not visible in the browser. I can see if I should save this file and reload it in my browser, I can see this part and this part here i am a comment will not be shown in the what in the browser let's save this and check now let us refresh this page so you can see it's not visible so i can see it's not visible so this is not so the comment is not visible in the browser so that is that about uh about the structure of html now let us go to our uh, today's topic uh about headings so we want to talk about what headings in what in html html have six levels of headings so let us create a new file for that let us create a new file let us name it headings Headings dot html. Don't forget your extension. Since we are writing a, an html document, so you the extension should be dot html. Then you save. So now this has this has been saved as a what as in as html page. Now to start with, let us write our html5 declaration. So let us declare since we are using the version of the uh, html5 version. So let us declare our you follow dot type i can see uh then html this should be the first thing you write and your head tag your head tag now in the head tag let us put a title a title and let us call the title ht oh sorry let us addings addings in ht HTML now and don't forget I say this title tag will be shown in which place in the browser so that is an assignment for you to to answer so now <laughs> let us uh, we have our body our body tag uh, body tag and uh, so so now before we let us run this let us let us copy this part and let us check it in our browser. Now, paste it. I can see we are still in the in the page HTML structure, but now we want to load another file in it. Don't forget in this place, which is the title. Uh, sorry, I said <laughs> which is HTML structure. Notice what notice how it is going to change when we run this browser now. When we run this now, so. Now I can see there's nothing in the body because there's nothing in the body tag in between this body tag of our headings.html file. So there's nothing there. But I can see we have what here now headings in HTML. So this is the title. So this is the word the title of our document headings in HTML, which is which can be found which can be found in which can be found sorry in the in between the a tag <laughs> sorry for that yeah so w as i say i want to talk about the uh i want to talk about headings but before we go what 
I am very sure most of us know the essence of having an uh, Eddings in our tag. Uh, and Eddings also is very important as it is going to it it, it enhance SEO. So search, search engine uh, opt optimization. So don't worry, we are going to come to that uh, later in our course. So, but let us continue with this. We have six html has six levels of headings so ranging from h1 to h6 so the h1 is the is the one the highest or let me say the first heading in html and it is written as and we even use it in our last class h1 so h1 is the first heading let's call this heading one and let us save now let us check it in our browser i can see we have heading one now let us we have i said we have six level html has six levels uh, of heading now let us copy this and let us write the second heading paste it and just change this h2 heading two h2 then save it and run it in your browser again now you can see we now have what adding two so i can see the difference what is the difference the difference it is obvious as you, as you can see now let us complete the headings we have up to h6 uh h3 h4 H4, H5, H6, yeah so now this is the this this is the levels of these are the levels of html we have now in our in html document from age one toward age six now let us now save this and uh check it in our browser refresh your browser now you can see these are the levels of what uh html we have now from age at h1 h1 h2 h3 h4 h5 h6 now so this is just what we are going to talk about today and um, before i go before we stop this class let me write this here like okay a comment i want to put a comment though not necessary so since we just done a comment so i want to utilize it so uh we have uh uh headings okay okay six six levels uh six levels of adding in HTML. So save and uh, and don't forget I said it is not visible in the browser. Refresh so that you can see it's not visible. Yeah. So uh, this is where we are going to stop for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this class. Please, if you enjoyed this class, kindly subscribe to our channel and give a like to our video. And please don't help us to share this. Uh, until we meet in our next. If you have any question comment below in the comment section and uh you we'll try as much as i can i will try as much as i can to get back to you now thank you very much